Okay, so criticize. Now I want you to clarify the Hatch Act. I want you to clarify for me what. You got to read. Why you're referencing that? I've briefly read it. Right. Um, It's referring to partisan races, and it. Yes. Do you know exactly how much funding is being allocated toward the candidate salary from federal funds? That's not my problem. I'm just bringing it to their attention. Okay. I, so, oh, but that's what about, the Hatch Act is saying: is that if you're getting money, federal or right. or any uh, por- me, portion of that, it's not for me to investigate. I'm just bringing it to their attention. Okay, so it's why are you bringing money. it to their attention? Because I don't want to lose our federal grant money, right? That's detrimental to our children because you're taking away. So okay. let me. Uh, well, here, here's here's some, here's a question I would like to ask you: Do you think Mayor Smith is in jeopardy? Of, of messing with that the Hatch Act's right. provision as you're citing it in your public comment. Right. So, are you recording? Yeah. Georgia is a one way. <laughs> Georgia is a one way state. Gotcha. So here we. And go. you're a public candidate. So here yes, I'm recording. You. That's fine. Thanks for letting me know. Um, so I'll make this statement. My duty is to report. If I don't report, then I am guilty for letting it happen. I appalled at such behavior of child exploitation. This person is a school teacher, and he is running for mayor. An investigation needs to be conducted. These are our children's we're talking about. Okay, I have another question. If there is a mishandling of funds, if there is fraud, waste, and abuse, that is unacceptable. That is stealing from the children and taxpayers. The board has a duty to investigate if the Hatch Act modernization has been violated. We might lose our federal grants because of a teacher's action. Okay, I have another question. There is another candidate that gets his uh, uh, funding through uh, uh, through his nonprofit through federal dollars as well. Would he also be in violation of the provision that you're quoting? I'm bringing it to the attention of certain parts of our uh, institutions. Are there any other... Uh, my job is to bring it to the forefront and ask the thought-provoking questions. Okay, okay, so here's another question. I am not the one to decide what goes on. Okay, so here's another question. The question I have is, uh, is, he, is this candidate or any other candidate, for that matter, that's running for political office in Kingsland, which you are, um, that is being subsidized through federal dollars through their salary, uh, are they in... Should they also be investigated? They can be if there's any wrongdoing. It's across the board. If, if they're, uh, I know Mayor Smith works at TRF. I think another candidate works at TRF or some, you know, version of that. Should right. they also be investigated? Would you be pushing for their investigation publicly as well? At this point in time, I cannot comment on that because I don't have the answers. I have not done my but due diligence and research. But but now, you're asking the school board to investigate a candidate that could possibly get federal funding of his salary. So would you be willing to also do that as well for other candidates? Would you also be going to their bosses and ask them to investigate them as well? Will you be doing that? To be continued. So you're not, so we don't know if you're going to do that or not. To be continued. So why are you singling out this one candidate? I found it. I was at, a, I was at St. Mary's Festival, and all these thought-provoking questions came to mind. And so I did a little research, I did a little soundboarding, and we found the Hatchet Act modernization 2012. You're also said in your public comments... I don't have all the answers. I but, don't you, but you also said in your public comments that, that there's, there could be a potential for child exploitation. Would you care to elaborate on that more? I found three definitions uh, via Internet. I wish I could find... Um, how do I say this? I think state.gov is a great resource. Okay, so why, why are you bringing up the, the idea of sexual exploitation, or chi- in this case, child exploitation? Why are you, why, just, why, is this, why are you concerned with that definition right. as, when you're referencing this political candidate? Should you be right. referencing other political candidates 
that that like Buddy Carter, I, who may have, I, whom he's also getting right. federal dollars from the government right. to be a congressman and has children in his campaign. Would you so, also be filing a complaint or so, ask for an investigation for Buddy Carter? I came here as a concerned citizen. But you're also I'm, a political I'm here. candidate. I am a political candidate, but not here because I cannot campaign on this property. I am not campaigning okay. on this property. I am here as a conservative but would, citizen. Would you be doing That's this it. if you were not a political candidate? Yes, I would. I'm a concerned citizen. Okay. I'm protecting the interests of our neighbors. I'm protecting the interests of the taxpayers. All I want to do is give back to the community. I want to protect their assets. Okay. So, so will you be following up with the school board to see if they do an investigation? Uh, yes. I don't expect a response from them today, but I do expect some kind of response. Will you be doing your own independent investigation under the Open Records Act in Georgia? At this point in time, I cannot comment. Okay. How about thanks for your time? <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> well, those, are, those are some serious uh, things that you brought up in public. So that... Right. It's a thought.